All right, first off, there's absolutely nothing wrong with the games I'm about to say, generally. I enjoyed most of them, but I enjoyed most of them for about two to three hours and then didn't play them again and probably said to somebody, that's a really fun game that I enjoyed for about two to three hours. So, nothing wrong with time spent in a game you didn't finish. And here are some of my favorites from this year. Ape Out, an outstanding audio and visual accomplishment about an ape busting out of different types of facilities that I felt I kind of got the most of and what I wanted out of it within a few hours. After that, I think I was kind of done. Wilmot's Warehouse, a game mostly centered around ranging your icons according to your own indecipherable system or by color, if you're one of those, you know, super color seeing mutant type of people. It's good times, it can be stressful times, but for me it was limited times because after a few hours I put it in. Yoshi's Crafted World. I thought this one would go the distance with the kids, with me, but after a few hours of playing it, especially with the kids, I realized it was going to be way too frustrating an experience. The co-op is not something I found fun or entertaining, and it was definitely a bummer uh, because everything else seemed to have all the pieces that would have made a fun game to play with the family. Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. This one is a lot of fun, especially in short bursts. I really enjoyed all the dumb stuff you can do in it, and even the structured campaign is pretty enjoyable. After a while though, I think I felt like I'd exhausted the, my personal well of goofing off in the game and was ready to take a break and put it down. Still, loads of fun for the time I spent with it. Nice! Yeah! Wow. Yep. Baba is you. Okay, this one's kind of an outlier on this list because I do really love the concept, even the presentation, and I will likely spend more time with it at some point. My issue is I found it exhausting. And whenever I would finish a puzzle, I would just shut it off and be like, oh, okay, I think I got everything I got out of it. So I guess it's not really the game's fault that I'm an idiot, or is it? So those are the games I spent a few hours with that I actually really enjoyed. The games were not bad. For some reason or another, I just didn't continue playing them, but generally they're okay. Ah, maybe Yoshi's Crafted World isn't that great. But the rest of them are really good. Uh, and if it's worth it to you, you should go check them out. Go watch a quick look of them on GiantBomb.com, for example. See if the game is right for you. 